Hello everybody, it's Chibi, and today I'm here to bring you a weekly vlog. We have hit 41k achievements. It's crazy. The, the number is getting faster and faster by the week because the last vlog, last week's vlog I did was for 40k. We're about to hit like 42k, but we're on 41k, but we're like almost to 42. So it's just, it's completely insane to see how fast our community is growing week by week. It's just... It's impressive, and I just want to say welcome all new Chibits to the community. Hopefully you all have some great discussions in the comments because a lot of Chibits like coming up with some really amazing theories, especially on some really awesome epic chapters of Taizai. So anyways, before I dive into this vlog, I just want to qu quickly state something real quick. If you did not know, earlier this week on Friday and Saturday morning pretty much, I was kind of sick, and I was really sick Friday. Like, I couldn't really, you know, eat anything that day. A lot of you knew if you actually watched my Death Parade video, and a lot of you have been asking for the past couple days, where is the fairy tale review? Like, where is that review from Friday, you know, the fairy tale episode review? Well, the fairy tale episode review is on hold this week, because, like I said, I was way too sick Friday. Like, I... I wanted to get the Death Parade, Assassinations Classroom, Garo, and JoJo out, and then I went to sleep right after that. Like, I just passed out. That's what I did. And I woke up around, like, 12 o'clock at night, and I'm like, no, nope, I'm just going back to sleep. So, yeah, I, I was just really sick Friday, and I didn't want to really just sit around and do another review, so I decided to skip Fairy Tale since it was a filler episode. It's a filler, not anything really important to the overall grand scheme of things, so I was like, okay, I'll just skip it. So just letting you all know, giving you a brief update on that if you did not realize why I skipped Fairy Tale this uh, previous, you know, Friday. So before I go any further, I want to open up this fan mail package that a fellow achievement sent me. There is... No name on it, has my name on it, but I don't see, you know, a name from the fellow chief that sent it. So, let's open this up and see what is inside. It Actually, before I do that. You hear that? I wonder what that is. I've been wondering, I got this package about probably four days ago. I, I've had it on my dresser and all that, and I'm like, I really want to open this up. But, I, you know, I'm waiting for the weekly vlog before I open it up. But it's, it looked really interesting, like the way it, the sound coming from it sounds interesting. So, what do we have in here? We have a letter right off the bat, as I can see. Okay, let's read this letter before I open it up here. I'll show you what this is right here. Whatever that is, I don't know what that is, but we'll f figure it out. So, what kind of... Oh, we have a dual-page letter. Okay, so let's start on the uh, page number one. Dear Chibi, by the time this package reaches you, our community would have hit 40k achievements. We're at 41k to be exact. Simply astonishing when you consider that nearly a year ago, YouTube nearly shut down your channel for good. Actually, that terrible incident may have been a blessing in disguise since it got so many people in the anime community to help you out in your darkest hour, myself included. Without all of you, I wouldn't be here. I've said that. I, I wouldn't. I've said that countless times before. Without all of your support, I wouldn't be here right now being able to express myself with all of you. Okay, uh, it was because of the community standing up for one of their own that made you into, I believe, one of the go-to reviewers of anime you are now. Here's hoping that does not happen again, coming from someone who had also lost his channel for over a year. Don't worry, I didn't and will never work for YouTube, so it came off as more of an annoyance in losing everything. Anyway, Chinese New Year's around, so I'm feeling very generous. So here are some more gifts for you if you don't know what Chinese New Year is. Nothing a quiet Google search won't solve. Really, I've heard about Chinese New Year, but I know nothing to... Yeah, I know next to nothing about it. I guess I will have to Google search that. Um, previously, I had sent you five examples of the Marvel anime. Well, he Oh! You sent me the- oh, you sent me that one package. Okay. Well, here's the last work Madhouse did for that, so enjoy. Next up, since you're such a big fan of the Index and Railgun series, I figured you'd see the latest chapter in the story of that series' universe. Wait, whoa, whoa, let me read that again. Next up, since you are such a big fan of the Index and Railgun series, I figured you should see the latest chapter in the story of that series' universe. Now, I'm just gonna let you know, I'm not up to date with the manga, or light novels of Railgun, or Index. I've only watched the anime of Railgun, and Index. That's all I've seen. I've seen the first two seasons of Index, first two seasons of Railgun. Um, let's see, where was that? Oh yeah, two, uh, no, two words describes your third gift, surprisingly good. Two words, surprisingly good, okay. It's a series where I recommend that you don't judge it by its premise and cover. It'll have a significant amount of fan service, but never too much, unless you watch its specials. 
But don't take my word for it. Ask the Chibit community what they think about it, since I'm sure a good number of them have seen it. If you like the series, I hope you catch its third season as set to air in spring. Lastly, while the cards in the box are for you, what is really important is the flash drive in there with them. A digital note explaining its contents will be in it. Regarding that drive, please for, uh, forgive its slow speed when transferring data, but I have no other one with its size. Oh, we have a third page here. Well, that is the last of it, Chibi. To your channel's bright future, in time, I'll tell you my full name. For now, I'll leave you guessing. Sorry for the long letter. Your friend, B-O-L, or Bio... Bionetic clean me on YouTube. I think I have an idea who this is, but besides, you know, the YouTube name, I think I have a good idea who this might be, but I don't know. I'll be shooting in the dark. We'll, we'll have to see in the future. But anyways, bi uh, Bionic cleaning me. I think that's how you say it? P.S. I write on one side to avoid smearing the paper, which will render this letter unreadable later on. By the way, you never did answer my question of who your favorite Japanese voice actor is. In case you're wondering, mine is Yuri Hore. Uh, my favorite Japanese voice actor is Rei. You know, the Sundare Rei. She voices Kagura from Gintama. She voices a lot of Sundare characters. You know, Rei is one of my favorite female voice actors of all time. Just straight up. she She's amazing. So, there you go. That's my favorite voice actor. So, I think I'm done with the letter, and let's set this aside to right here, and let's open up this package to see what- Oh, wow. <laughs> okay, so we have Avengers Confidential Black Widow Punisher, all new Marvel animated movie. Look at that. Here, I'll, I'll back it up for you guys. Look at that, it's holographic. It's badass. Let's see. Oh, it's unopened blue. Oh, shit. Let's see, it comes with the Vigilante versus the Spy special features hmm gonna have to watch this i'm gonna have to binge watch all these i really am blu-ray dvd combo pack badass i like black widow black widow needs her own movie um whoa what is yo really i didn't know they had i didn't know there was a movie to index a certain magical index to movie the miracle of indy meon I, I, I did not know there was a movie. Yeah, there's a movie. That There really was a movie to end it? What the fuck? Is this like new content? Like, is this like new stuff? I'm guessing you said the latest chapter. I'm guessing this takes place after season two of Index. I'm guessing. Yo, I'm gonna have to watch this. I have to watch this because I haven't seen that. Yo, I knew it. Oh my god. Yo, okay, so I guess that I'm gonna have to now. Well, you just put me in a spot. You just put me in a spot. Shit. Shit. <laughs> okay, so <sighs> High School DXD. The one series that has been recommended to me the most. Like, out of the, all the series that's been recommended to me constantly, I mean, constantly is this series recently and so many chibits want me to watch it like okay so here's the thing this, this is all of season one and all of season two so it's all of season one and season two right here let me show you each individual for you can see for yourself season one i'm guessing that's season one here's the back cover of it season one and then season two i am guessing since it has like the new thing right there and then the back cover of season two so here's the thing i have a little bit of a history when it comes to fan service series and i'm usually not one to go out of my way to watch this type of series but i've been told that this series is different from the average fan service harem i've been told that the story and plot not the actual plot of opi i'm talking about the actual plot is very good for this series since Bionic, you're so willing to send me this. I'll give it a shot. I'll give it a shot. I will see how I truly feel about it. I know there's a season three coming out this upcoming season. A lot of you have begged me to want to watch this, you know, series. And we'll have to see. Like, I'll give it a shot. I have a lot right now to do. Like, a lot to watch Code Geass, for instance. I might do a full season review. Because, I mean, I really need to catch up to that and start Full Metal Alchemist. But, yeah. Blu-ray DVD combo pack. Hmm. 
So yeah, I'll, I'll give it a shot. We'll, we'll, we'll see. I'll, let me set these to the side, okay? I'll, I'll give it a shot. I, I we'll just see how that goes. Whoa. Yu-Gi-Oh cards. Okay, Ultra Pro Gaming Series. You said the flash drive has something on it. Like, I remember you said that, so... I'll have to load it up later and see what it is. And I'll update you all, guys, in the next vlog video what it is. So, can I... Oh. Oh, that's cool. It's a cute little... It's stuck. There you go. It's, I'm just afraid I'll break it. But, cute little flash drive. It's cute. Very tiny. 32 gigs?! This thing holds 32 fucking gigs. Look, see it. Like, I don't know if you can see the writing out there. It's probably too small for the camera for you guys can see it. But 32 gigs. Holy shit. That's a lot of gigs for this tiny little ass flash drive. God. Okay, so I'll have to load that up. And I'll, like I said, I'll update you guys all on that on the next vlog to see what that is about. Okay, so what kind of Yu-Gi-Oh cards do we have in here? So, I'm kind of out of date when it comes to Yu-Gi-Oh, like, I'm out of touch and stuff, like, I, I used to play Yu-Gi-Oh and stuff when GX was around, but I don't know all the new cards and stuff like that, and the new Beast, you know, Yu-Gi-Oh Beast or whatever, you know, the new tops, okay? Don't butcher me. So, ooh, Red Dragon Archfiend, dude, that's badass looking. Red Dragon Archfiend, Kaiser, Miracle Dragon, a lot of different dragons. Let's see, uh, the Light Hex Sealed Fusion. Lion Alligator. Hedge Guard. That, that looks cool. It's holographic. That looks badass. I don't know if you can see that or not. Um. Lever Eater. Oh, a Catapult Turtle. I know that one. That's a really cool card. I like that. Okay, that's one little small section of it. Um. Is there any that's out? Like, it'd be cool if there was a Blue Eyes in here or something. I like Blue Eyes. Or maybe Obelisk the Tormentor. Man, there's so many fucking cards. Look at that shit. Okay, so let me just, let me just cut this deck in half and just you know look at it. Um, oh that's oh that's cute, Key Mouse. That, that that's cute. It's that's very fucking cute. Chow Chow Chun, Chow Chow Chun. Wow. Okay. Um. Hmm. Anything in here? Oh, my Megamorph. I like that. I used to use that a lot. Oh, that's that's cute. That's that's fucking cute too. Like I would use all the Kawaii cards. You know, the little cutie cards like fairies and stuff or toontown type cards you know you know what i'm talking about the the toon cards god i, I it's been so, forever since i've watched Yu-Gi-Oh. don't butcher me Yu-Gi-Oh fans please don't um a lot of dragons and blackwing cards hmm let's see solar wind jammer fortress warrior Ooh, that looks badass right there fortress warrior does trap master monster reborn what are monster reborns in here um, hmm, Chain Ignition. Okay, that's the first half of that. Let's look at this. Hopefully there's an Obelisk. I, I like Obelisk a lot. Giga Power. Hmm, Wasteland. Inmato. That, that, that's ingenious. That's an ingenious name right there. Inmato. It's like inmate. That's, that's fucked up, man. Okay, that, that's cool. I like the new designs of some of these cards. It's really cool. Worm Victory. Dude, that dude looks crazy as hell. Look at that. Worm Victory. It's holographic, too. It's cool. Ice Princess Zenefolt. I, I think that's how you say the name. There's that card. It, whoa, that looks cool. 2,500 attack power. I will now lay down my trap card. Hmm. I'm just looking through all these cards. Ascending Soul... Monster Reborns out the ass in here. Like, there's a lot of Monster Reborns. Evo Price. Oh, Token Bayum. Oh, it's uh, one of those goblin type cards. Burst Rebirth. Some really cool looking cards in these new generation of Yu-Gi-Oh cards. Ah, uh, Drillroid. I, I, like, I liked him. I used to use that card a lot. Uh, whoa. Gigantic Castle, or whatever it's called. Look at that. that that's badass. 2,900 tap power. Wow, that's... Wobble the Greater. Whoa, these cards look badass. Look at that. I like the white effect on that. That looks really cool. Dude, that's a badass looking holographic card. Let's see. Mm, Chaos Infinity. Karibon. Dude, a Karibo. Like, it, it's a female Karibo. What the fuck? When did this happen? When did a Karibo become female? What the hell? That's cute. 
That's fucking cute. That, that's the best card. That's that's single-handedly the best card of this right here. Cremon, okay? That, that, that's that's cute, okay? So, that's the entire deck. That's that's awesome, though. You're, you're trying to turn me into a Yu-Gi-Oh fan, aren't you? Like, Bionic, you're, you're trying to turn me into a Yu-Gi-Oh fan. So, pretty much, I'm going to go try to watch these later tonight. Yeah, I might sit down, try to watch these later tonight, see. Might give a first impressions on it. You know, it depends on all of you if you want to see a first impressions on High School DXD or not. But we'll have to see how many of you want that. Let's see here. I will do a first impressions on this as soon as tomorrow. Tomorrow as soon as tomorrow, Tuesday at the latest, just depending, if this video gets, three hundred likes before, no, three hundred likes after eight hours after upload time, okay, so after eight hours pass, if it doesn't have three hundred likes, then I might eventually give a first impressions, but I will get out of first impressions as early as tomorrow or Tuesday if it does, you know, in eight hours. So we'll have to see. But anyways, you all have a wonderful day or night. Bionic, thank you very, very much. Whoa, I don't want to drop that. Thank you very, very much for these gifts. It's just, you spoil me too much, Chibits. You spoil me way too much. Happy Chinese New Year's for all of you wherever you live. I, I don't know exactly what dates that's on because, like I said, I'm kind of no next to nothing when it comes to Chinese New Year. But, I mean, please forgive me for that. But I still wish you all a happy Chinese New Year because, hey, I mean, I still all want you to have a wonderful rest of the year. So, yeah, you all have a wonderful day or night wherever you live. And before I end this video, just going to give you a brief update. I am feeling a lot better when it comes to me being sick, like I was sick Friday, I was sick, you know, yesterday, and I was slightly sick today, but I'm feeling a little bit better today, I don't feel as sickish, so I'm just letting you all know I am feeling a lot better today, so don't worry about that, I, I know some of you might worry, it just depends, but yeah, you all have a wonderful day or not wherever you live, please be safe, Chibits, thank you, thank you for the support, I love you all so much, I wouldn't be here without all of you, Chibi out.